Major components of earwax include cerumen, produced by a type of modified sweat gland, and sebum, an oily substance. Both components are made by glands located in the outer, two, ear canal. The chemical composition of earwax includes long-chain fatty acids, both saturated and unsaturated, alcohols, squalene, and cholesterol. Earwax also contains dead skin cells and hair, 3. Excess or compacted cerumen is the buildup of earwax causing a blockage in the ear canal, 2, and it can press against the eardrum or block the outside ear canal or hearing aids, potentially causing hearing loss. Treatment Movement of the jaw helps the ear's natural cleaning process. The American Academy of Otolaryngology discourages earwax removal unless the excess earwax is symptomatic. While a number of methods of earwax removal are effective, their comparative merits have not been determined. A number of softeners are effective, however, if this is not sufficient, 28, the most common method of cerumen removal is syringing with warm water, 29. A curette method is more likely to be used by audiologists and otolaryngologists when the ear canal is partially occluded and the material is not adhering to the skin of the ear canal, but due to the high skill level needed to not damage the eardrum, is limited. 5. Cotton swabs are not recommended as they push most of the earwax farther into the ear canal and remove only a small portion